is a typed letter, no signature. Your threats are worthless, Kelsey. No one will believe a dropout over me, and if you keep this up, I can make your life hell. You'll never get into another college, and you may never even find a decent job. Put an end to this before it's too late. Something was ripped off here. I can still see the bottom of the letters that were on it. The Dean wrote this? So that's what he's hiding. The financial records must be real. Why would he send this letter if they were faked? Dean Chapman? Hello, Agent Reed. It's something, but it's not enough on its own to go making threats. They'll probably continue to say she never worked here. Of course, Agent, any time. Now I need some physical proof to tie him to this letter. Yeah, it's time the Dean and I had a talk about this. I don't need anything else from those files. Something was ripped off here. I can still see the bottom of the letters that were on it. They match! This was written on official Berkeley stationery. So, Kelsey threatened the Dean with these stolen financial records, and he sent her that letter to get her to back down. The idiot even used his own stationery. I think it's time Dean Chapman and I had a little talk. One more time, Chapman. Is there anything else you want to tell me? No, I've told you everything. I really hate being lied to. First you lied about knowing Kelsey and that she worked here. Now you're lying about why she stopped working here, when, and why she dropped out altogether. You have no proof of any of that. These files prove that you've been taking gifts from the Susie K. Lending Institution for at least four years. Students get referred and ripped a new one on interest rates, and suddenly you're going on really nice family vacations, instruments signed by Yo-Yo Ma and the Beatles. That's, uh, there's no, those are falsified reports. 
I highly doubt it. And a little scrutiny from the experts will prove one way or the other. How are you feeling about your odds in that bet, Daniel? This letter was sent to Kelsey's personal post office box months ago. Whoever wrote it ripped off the top to conceal the letterhead. What has that got to do with me? They didn't rip quite enough off. The bottom of a few letters are left. Letters that match your office stationery. That's all that proves is someone used a piece of Berkeley stationery to write this. Do you know how many officers carried that? You're right. But that's not all there is. The letterhead, these financial records, plus the fact that Kelsey had access to this office and your reports. And your personnel records over there will no doubt back that up. And the fact that you lied about knowing her? I think I've got a great story for the Boston Globe. How about you? What do you want? The truth, you piece of shit. Did Kelsey Gardner work in your office? Yes, she did. And why was she fired? She threatened me. She said she had proof that I was corrupt, and if I didn't get her scholarship back, she'd turn me in. So you threatened her right back? I thought it'd make her back off. You knew she was never gonna get a loan from them, didn't you? Who they give money to is out of my hands. I just refer people, that's all and collect all the perks paid for in interest by your students. It's a, a consultant's fee. It's a conflict of interest the size of Russia, and it's illegal, jackass. How many students are living off ramen thanks to your referrals while you're taking trips to Dubai? What happened the last time you spoke with Kelsey? She came here to tell me she was dropping out, and uh, she said she would go to the police with a file. She was screaming threatening, out of control, and I was honestly scared. I sent that letter to make her back off. I never heard from her, and then she went missing. How convenient for you. I told you, I had nothing to do with her disappearance. Now we're getting somewhere. What else are you hiding? I, I got a package this morning. I, I think it's from Kelsey. It came by messenger, and inside it was this charm. Another silver charm. Consider yourself lucky to be alive, Chapman. The victims all were found with charms like this. I'm a target? Well, you need to help me. You need to protect me. Don't worry. You'll be very safe down at the station. What? I'm FBI, Chapman. Did you really think I wasn't going to tell the police about this? Do yourself a favor and don't leave town. The boys in blue will be in touch soon. Oh, no. I kind of hate it when I need to save assholes like you. I'll give Kelsey this much. She had every reason to hate you. That's a lot of blood. What happened? That's the alley where Longmore was.